arm wax in three minutes. So if someone has arms, I'll do arms. I'll do your whole arm. Yeah, you can do it. Yeah. Three minutes, both arms? Yeah, I can do them. Do you guys have any questions? Or it's um in see me or um, they just moved. It's in Camarillo. Oh, that's oh, they were that's Sarah. Sarah. Yes, 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 I'm very close to Sarah. Yeah, I didn't mm -hmm. realize it because she's basically she's what happened is I used to buy their wax from there for years. I don't they don't they're not my employer. I'm self-employed. I'm an advanced educator, but my main place of where most people go and take my classes is Aesthetics International. Yeah, I used to take classes. So um. I don't do my manscaping class there. I have a studio that I do it out of. Um, I don't do any lash tinting or anything like that. Um, you guys have one up on estheticians. Legally, they're not really supposed to be using any type of hair dye. We do, but we're not supposed to. Um, but you guys are, so you guys are able to do lash tinting and all that good stuff. Do you guys You can't be afraid to go on the hairline. A lot of times when doing brows, people are afraid to pull because you're scared if you pull, you're going to pull the wrong hair. But that's where you, that's what makes you guys separate you. Because if I was afraid, I would never be able to have a waxing business. The number one thing that you need to have in waxing is confidence. Um, have you ever botched somebody? Yeah, of course. I've ripped full brows off. Are you kidding me? Yeah, you all are going to do it. You're going to burn somebody. But the difference is, is not letting it take away your self-worth of a waxer. You need to go, oops, <laughs> shit happens next. <laughs> yeah, she won't be coming back. <laughs> yeah, that's when you, you know, you just got to have a personality and, you know, um, I mean, it hasn't happened recently. Does it grow back the same? Yeah, it grows back. I mean, it's just hair. Uh, she's all, have you ever butchered anybody? Absolutely. Yeah, I mean, I'd be lying if I told you I haven't. Have you guys ever cut somebody's hair too crooked? I mean, of course. How do we learn? Trial and error. So, um, no, they signed a consent form. First things first, save your butt, make a consent form. You know, and I can go over that. But yeah, I don't normally be like, hey, let me watch you. You know, I want to save my... But, but yeah, no, no one's going to sue you because by the time it gets down to it, with the nitty gritty, their brows back, there ain't no, there's nothing there, you know? Um, I didn't double dip, I flipped, just so you know. Any other questions? Do you, do you ever wear gloves? When you I Brazilian? don't wear gloves when I'm doing Brazilians or anything. Do you, you can, it's all preference. It sticks. I don't, I'm, I'm up in your nitty gritty. I don't need like latex like slapping you back and forth. <laughs> so, uh, okay, note to self. Make sure you don't open your eyes when you're waxing your eyebrows. <laughs> oh my gosh, I didn't think I needed to tell you people. Close your eyes, girl. <laughs> okay, so this happens a lot. So now all of her eyelashes are stuck. Not a problem. I'm not sweating it. It's cool. This is like, so what do we do? <laughs> We give it a second, and we let all these come down onto her eyes with the stickiness, okay? That's fine. I'm not even tripping. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to stick this on. Oh, my God, girl. It's all good. It's all good. We don't sweat the small things here. All I need to do is make sure that my strip is not on her eyelashes at this point. That's my concern. We're making sure. Because I can get it off. Not a problem. But I'm also going, girl, I got three people oh. waiting behind you. What you doing to my schedule? <laughs> <laughs> so you guys see, I just did that. And now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go in with this oil. <laughs> no, open your eyes. <laughs> awesome. Oh, gee. This cat. Note to self, you want to make sure your clients don't open up their eyes during an eyebrow wax. Silly girl, tricks are for rabbits. 
she of course it feels like you've got eye burgers. It feels like you've got eye snot going on. Like, so just, we'll wash it off. It won't, your eyelash is good now. It, you're good to go. Let me do the other brown and then we'll work on that. She's like, alright, anyway. But do you guys see the difference of her eyebrow? We can actually see that she has eyebrows. I know, right? Don't open your eyes. You're on video. Don't open your eyes. Look, Seth. <laughs> that was awesome. <laughs> I bet. So honestly, if I can give you one piece of advice, the one thing you guys want to all be is friends in this group. No matter how clicky and how like ridiculous it gets, I guarantee you, the one you don't get along the most with will be your partner in crime. Guaranteed. It doesn't not happen all the time. All the time. Um, did I mention I got kicked out of beauty school? <laughs> well, that'll happen. Be nice to people. <laughs> Guess what? I teach them now. It sucks to be them. <laughs> Apparently, I passed.